MLS and Latin America team of the season it is going to be released this Monday at 6 p.m. UK time that is how it's been with this weekly schedule and we're going to be taking a look in this video at the best cards that are going to be getting a team in the season and also how it's going to be affecting the league one team of the season rewards so just before we get into it if you are new here make sure that you do subscribe we are going to be doing daily team of the season videos lots more predictions and information on Ultimate Team of the Season, footies, all of the future promos. So definitely make sure that you are subscribed so you do not miss any of those future videos. So getting straight into this one now, just like last week, Serie A was in Foot Champions Rewards, not on its own, but also with the Chinese Super League and also Eredivisie. So this week it is going to be the same format. We are going to have two extra leagues, the two smaller leagues. So along with League One, with MLS and Latin America, those are going to be the two one so taking the very hyped league one team of the season rewards plays down a level because it is going to be mixed with these cards which is quite unfortunate but of course there's nothing we can do only secure that gold two which means that we are guaranteed a league one player but from the rewards where i have been seeing even gold three silver one are getting a lot of luck with the major league so fingers crossed we are going to get good rewards on thursday that is for all of us because weekend league is just so strenuous these days so we all know what the popular MLS league is it's just the main American league there is of course they're going to be players like Carlos Vea everyone like that but what exactly is Latin America you might see the short Latin and basically it's a mix of players from the Mexican Argentinian Colombian and Chilean leagues all together in one so players from like Copa Libertadores everything like that for example Tevez he should still be getting in team in the season that's going to move on perfectly to our little bit of a predictions I do think Carlos Vea like I did mention he should be getting a pretty nice card also there is going to be Martinez you might remember him from the past he's always had quite very pacey cards and he's been quite good so maybe could be a super sub something like that that's how he has been in the past another card I do think could potentially get in here is actually Opera he has had an absolutely insane SBC card that is sometimes even seen now in Fit Champions or at least when I'm taking a look reviewing teams a lot of people do use him and try and include him in there so maybe Maybe if you already have him right now, you might be excited if he does get a team in the season. I'm not sure how he's played in real life, but just because he is, of course, a hyped MLS card, the most hyped one maybe this year, I think EA could want to include him in here just for hype reasons to sell those packs. Another player in here is going to be Nani. He could potentially get in here. Again, this is going to be a reason for EA to sell packs. Definitely would be a very popular card as a team in the season. Very well known from past FIFAs. Could maybe even be a flashback team in the season card. There is potential for for that and that is also similar with Ibrahimovic because he's just transferred over away from the MLS maybe he could get a flashback team the season card I'm not too sure how that is going to be working there is a potential for a few cards to be in here maybe coming off the bench are going to be very good very overpowered like that opera maybe even as a sense back or again Carlos Vea Martinez those sort of cards maybe a Tevez as long as they're not too expensive but to be honest it's not as good as the Chinese Super League or Edivisi and I do think it is going to be bringing down the League One rewards. So again, fingers crossed we're not going to be getting many of these cards in our red player picks on Thursday. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys are excited about any of these MLS or Latin America cards. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time.